Salve to spectators, it's Masterpost. Welcome back to Europa Universalis 4, Rights of Man as Brandenburg. Not too successful, but not bad at, uh, at all. We Oh, excellent, we have managed to get Cologne here. Back into good graces, also because aggressive expansion is ticking down. So that's fine. Uh, we have four seats now, this... four voices, I should say. There's no problem at all. Probably are these 80% Pomeranian separatists. Well, my voice exhaustion is slow. It should tick down by a half a percent here to 10.5, so this should help. Let's see about that. It did, that's good. Still at 80%, now 5.7%, excellent. We are now 8 points in the lead, this is good. Let's top off still relations with the other guys. Why does the Papal State not like me that much? Oh, we're still not yet there, okay, fine. Have you plundered this one? Yes. So, let's just siege other stuff so they get their war exhaustion down. We might have to help these guys here if they are... Huh. Mines is not at war. Oh wait, it's just parking his army there. Okay. Still 80%. Ticking down again. Why did it tick down now? War... Ooh, the, what? Wait, the war exhaustion... Ah! Ah, nice! The war exhaustion is going down. Because we're not at war. Actually, we're losing troops and then it gets, goes up. But it goes down instantly because we're not at war ourselves. That's nice. That's really useful. Why didn't I park my troops in there? This is a min-maxing mistake. So we have one fort over here, and one over here, and one over here. They're still sieging over there, so that's fine. It's actually an AI mistake here. Why, why are they sieging this one? Can we siege their capital? Would be a huge bonus. But we, I need one more troop, I guess. Yeah, I do. I think they're coming now, so with them that would be perfect. Oh, come on, please go to me. Or not. Then I just loot the provinces. Why not? Excellent, so... 80% is fine, we got that down to 3.1, so let's have a look. Oh crap, it's 90%, okay. It's 4.7% now, I have to get back with my army and ma uh, put it in this province. There will be 11 province. The army will have 11 troops and where it spawns, I don't know. Let's get there. I want my two cavalry and I don't have enough money yet. Huh. So, for safety measures, you go out there for now and you loot for, in one, uh, for one month. Ooh, they got a, 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 quite a, a piast on their throne. Excellent. Uh, not excellent, interesting, I mean. What the hell? Non-enforcement of ordinances. A monarchs ruled by issuing ordinances, but they were almost powerless to enforce them. Enforcement depended upon the local powers, nobles, city, governments. They would not always be as vigilant as the monarch would have desired. Let them handle it. So again, in Rupin, 50 autonomy, increase attempts, this 50 admin power, or our prince elector will handle it. This option is available due to Friedrich's II having to trade lawgiver. Math autonomy change minus po I don't even want to lose 25 admin power, so I just do the autonomy in Rupin. It has nearly zero autonomy, and if we do that, it goes down by 0.15 each month. So what do we have here? It says 1.5 years. I cannot trust that at all. How's the war looking for you? Still negative. Why is that? I can't actually see it, but... They haven't sieged down anything. Why well, have they? No, they're still sieging. And 
we have one castle, so maybe maybe the battles count that much. What if we move both troops in there? I know it's quite ineffective here, but if I had one guy, well, I don't have a, a decrease unrest guy, priest or something. So we gain the the, the mission here. Because we have max out relations. Not max out, we'll do that even further to 125. They are losing quite badly. Interesting, what are they doing? Attack against Aragon. Ooh. Defender against France in the French Aragonese excommunication war. Interesting. Are they taking. Will they take anything? Uh, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> against. Is Castile and France allied? Uh, they are. That's bad. Oh god. Okay. I don't want to be Provence in these two provinces either when I'm 100% surrounded. Conquer Silesia is still an option. I would so love to attack them right now, but Poland is, is still allied there. Crap, and they're not doing anything. They're not going anywhere. Improve relations with Magdeburg. They're liking me decently enough. Um, We have... We could go to 100% or create a proper fleet. I don't have the money for that right now, so let's pick this mission and let's just do it. Check the. Yeah, we're still with four leads here, four votes. He's getting older, he is 42 now. Muscovy wants access. Why? We wrote Denmark, Sweden, Norway, and Mecklenburg. Why is that? Muscovite conquest of Kexholm. They are... Where's Kexholm? Here we go. Interesting. What the hell did Denmark do? Oh, is this ugly. Danish Karelia. Okay. So they get wasted. They're allied with Mecklenburg, so we could tr try sniping Mecklenburg here. So increase this by network. They're still doing fine because Bohemia is wasting itself there. Somebody wants Kondo Jerry. Who? Oh, it, it just got away. Now it's 2.9 years, but it can't happen every second now. And I don't want to increase the unrest. Well, actually, they are capped at 25 autonomy due to the estates. So that's okay. I don't want to deal with 11k troops. That's just too painful. And because we did one siege, we have a grace period here, I guess, before they complain because we're not doing enough. We have 42% progress here, 28 here, so it can go either way. Hopefully they will finish their... Ah, oh, they didn't do it. 42%. 35, nothing. Okay. I guess, well, there's now one year stick again. Where well, it should go down by 0.5 each. Interesting. We can build one cavalry. And we'll do that. Loot some more provinces and you go out there as well. Let's see. Unrest is a little bit higher now. Can we risk that? A 4.4% chance each month. Ooh, Bohemia accepted, accepted peace with Frankfurt. Now they're coming, or not. They're at war with Nassau now. They'll just pay war reps and give them a lot of money. Are you kidding? Why are you abandoning the siege now? What the hell? We were at 42%. Oh god. And all the Frankfurt... Oh, shit. This was so stupid. Now they're... Uh, okay, white piece. Interesting. Now my guys got black flag. Now if, if at this month's tick they spawn, it would be very bad. But I hope they don't. Then we can put our whole army, whole army in there. Nice. For once we have a little bit of good luck. Get in there. 
Okay, now it's five years. This is fine. We're losing quite a bit of money, however. What if we decrease to half? Do we still get a bonus here? I think so. Wait, friendly troops minus three. If we do it, if does this get updated within a month? I actually I don't want to risk that. <laughs> if they attack now, I get routed. <laughs> That's a little bit, a little bit risky. But I also cannot afford going into the negatives once more. Vote is still for us, only by margin, so Cologne must be kept on our side. Oh god, yeah, we got the treasury. Yeah, well, <laughs> I have one, I, I, I rather have one loan, because we have the inflation reduction guy, than... Hmm. Than fighting 11,000 troops. Corruption, okay. So... I guess Denmark gets wrecked. No, they're actually in the lead here. That's interesting. Moscow must be very confident. Poland isn't doing anything. They still have to choose there. I guess they will attack them once more. Maybe then I can swoop in, but I'm not really powerful here. Lüneburg? Oh, allied with Münster. That's not too big of a threat. Hmm. They're only... Oh, wait. They're allied with the Teutons. So this doesn't make much sense now, does it? Let's see about institutions. So, Siena and Florence have accepted, uh, and Mantua have embraced them as well completely. 4%, 5%, 23%. In Austria, it's spreading now quickly, I guess. Yeah, because they have adjacency bonus. 23 in Berlin, that's fine. We want to pump up it. Uh, and militarily, once more. We have the 20% now. We should get the. Second bonus, yeah, 0 0.8, 0 0.8, that's fine. So it, it, it spreads in Berlin even quicker. Quicklier. Okay, now it again December. Okay, in Greifswald it decreased completely. Now we reduce the army maintenance. We have a 0.8% chance now. This isn't really threatening. I want to improve with Cologne. Just enough to get to the 100% again. Oh, there was one offer. Let's let's wait if it pops once more. We can build one cavalry again. Let's do that. We can do the first idea. It's prestige decay minus one percent. It's decent, I guess, but not especially good. It's not the same as gaining one prestige per turn. It's actually worse. But are you ki are you kidding? Are you fucking kidding me? We had a 0.4% chance of... Oh, come on. This is just ridiculous. This is so ridiculous. We had a 0.4% chance. And they rebelled. This, it, it just can't be, right? This is, this, is, this is too ridiculous. Now we have to fight them. Come on, this is just a joke. And they will march there and we have to, I have to go out. Oh, is this stupid? Let's take another loan. Of course, I had to cancel the cavalry and build it here. Holy shit. This is, this is so bad. Yeah, of course, 10, 10 more separatism. This is so bad. So what, what about Unheard? Bavaria and Brunswick, Teutons and Bohemia. Hmm. Now Denmark wants Condor Terry. Yeah, now I can't give it to them. Wow. We have to improve with Magdeburg anyhow. To get into 100. Well, actually the border friction will be there anyway. That's bad. A traveling minstrel. Our own minstrel recently crossed our nation's borders. His intention is to roam our country, bringing joy to all who hear him. 
But some say only your ears are fit to hear such wonderful music. You bring him to court, gain 10 prestige, or the airway, of course, take the stability. Why are we at zero? Haven't we boosted it yet? No, okay, let's take this ability. Recall with Cologne again, so we're safely six in the lead. Just proof it there as well. But Lüneburg is only allied with Minster. I don't want to expand before getting the Emperor ship because then we have the aggressive expansion malus here. So let's improve prestige if we can and legitimacy. Then we would get a few more points. I want to attack there, Grasslands, before they get the bonus. So you will go then 28th June. You'll get down second, so we get the full morale tick. Excellent. So let's see about that. 5 to a 3 is fine. Of course, they get a 9. Now we have 6 to a 4, that's good. So we should be able to crush them rather handily. Denmark has a routed army here. Denmark, yeah, right. Decrease. So we can pay back our loans. We are at full army strength. We're making a little bit money. Alright. Next military attack isn't far away. When we get that, we can see about expanding again. Hopefully we get the Emperor for before. To the Golden Order Truce has ended. Magdeburg and Mecklenburg. So not at war with the Livonians anymore. Interesting. They didn't lose Ösel. That's interesting. What the happened there, I don't know. They have still a truce there, so they definitely were at war. Okay, eight points now in the lead. I want to have that. If Austria decides to do it. Cannot claim anything apart from that. We can start claiming something more from... Pomerania. Sadly here the autonomy increased, not the autonomy, but the unrest increased once more. Separatism is much higher than here now. Yeah, okay. Not making too much money, but the war reps... Oh, the war reps are for, two, uh, for 10 years anyhow. No, no matter how long the truce ta uh, has holds. What? England paid the debt of Austria. Why do, does Austria have a debt? Ah, they're war with France. Still. Okay, yeah, and th the papal state went down, but it's only 1%. The wars now are definitely more punishing and more drawn out affairs and more brutal, I guess. Hmm. I need more stuff. More profit. Uh oh. This is bad. Cologne has. Ah, shoot. I need more prestige and more legitimacy, and it doesn't really go up fast enough. Hmm. This is bad. We might have to ally with Cologne. This is a strong bear here. Um, so let's see. How old is he? Well, 45, he can die any day. It's always the case. What are our alliances here? We have Saxony. Uh, Saxony and Mainz we need for sure. I think we can cancel our alliance with Hungary. It would piss them. Or we just pay one Diplo power. I think it's easily worth it when we get the Emperor ship. So let's just do the alliance. So we get back in the level 4. Excellent. Um, I ha somehow have to give them one more opinion. If it doesn't work with military access. Hmm. Could send them a gift. Can't even go for 25 gold. Build spy network, counter espionage. I actually can't do it, holy crap, <laughs> this is stupid. Denmark wants Condottieri. I think we do it because we need the money. 
They are paying 1.4, that's not too great, but I will go for it. Nice. March up there. We can pay back our loan. Oh, nope, not take one. Repay loan. Oh, actually, we can't repay this one. Oof. Losing quite a lot of money here. Yeah, we lost a lot with this rebellion, with this stupid rebellion. Too many diplo relations. Yeah, I know that. Wait. Ooh, they are, there were two barks, not two galleys, so we can start protecting trade. Lubeck, I guess. Let's check. Yeah, we're in a Lubeck node with our capital, that's good. Alright. So, be all for this episode. I thank you all for watching for now. And apart from some stupid minor mistakes here, namely declaring war on the Teutons and then having this stupidity, which I I guess I'm innocent of. We are doing fine, and we, I hope we get the Emperorship in the next episode or the next few episodes. I will see you soon.